All righty, let's do one and two of the centroids lab right now. Um, first one we have is a rectangle, okay? And for the rectangle, we know that it's going to be um, half of the uh, width and half of the height. So we just are going to have our base, which is 0.75 divided by 2, get our answer there. And that's going to be our x value, all right, our y is going to be 0.5 divided by 2. All right, so we get a um, 0.37, or we'll just say 0.38 for our x, and we'll get a 0.25 for our y. All right, now the next one. So we have that it's going to be a third of the way in here and a third of the way up. Okay, so your centroid is somewhere in that direction. All right. Now, so we're going to have, um, we're going to do our 0.5 divided by 3 for our x. And we are going to do our uh, 1 divided by 3 for our y. Now, what I say in the instructions is that we want to have our origin in the bottom left corner. Okay, so let's first just do those numbers. So we have um, 0.5 divided by 3, which is going to be 0.2. All right. And then we have um, 1 divided by 3, so we get a 0.33 and so on. All right. I'm gonna make the real number for that 0.5 divided by uh, 3. Oh, let me fix that. That's not 0.2. Let's do 1.667. Okay. Uh, point one six six seven, okay, and this point three three three, all right. So that would be our answer, except that I I tell everyone to have the origin on the uh, bottom left corner. So what you have to do for your x is really do, it's this far. It's going to be this far in from the end, so you have to subtract it. So really, it would be uh, point five minus the 0.1667 and the height of 1 minus the 0.333. Okay, so my uh, 0.5 minus the uh, 0.667 is going to be um, the 0.333. All right. All right, and the um, 1 minus 0.333 is going to be 0.667. Okay, all right, so there we go for, for those two answers.